What's going on everyone? This is Kevin here, and it looks like Total Wireless is now a thing of the past and they're now known as Total by Verizon. So in this video, I'm gonna be going over everything that there is to know about this rebrand, and it's definitely really exciting to see. So right now, if you head over to the Total Wireless website, it will forward you over to totalbyverizon.com, and you can see here that there's a pop-up right in the middle that says Total Wireless is now Total by Verizon. And to my understanding, this is essentially a move to better compete with Metro by T-Mobile, Cricket Wireless, and Boost Mobile. So Verizon has been very aggressive about expanding into the prepaid space. They do of course have Verizon prepaid, they have Visible as well, and they got a hold of the Total Wireless brand when they acquired TrackPhone back in late 2021. Now, if you're not aware of that, that was a pretty big deal when that happened, and it looks like this is one of many things that Verizon is doing as a result of that acquisition, but TrackPhone itself is a really big deal. So for example, you can see in this press release, back in 2019, TrackPhone had 20 million customers, $8.1 billion in revenue. They also have a presence in more than 90,000 retail locations. So Walmart, Target, Dollar General, Family Dollar, Best Buy, and more. And I know from personal experience, I do see a large track phone presence in these stores when I'm at them. Now, if you head over to the track phone website and you go to brands, you can see all the various brands listed here. And there's definitely a lot of very familiar ones. And many of these I've covered devices from them here in the channel in the past. So you can see one of them that's listed is indeed Total by Verizon. We also have SafeLink Wireless, Walmart Family Mobile, Net10 Wireless, and a few other ones that I'm not quite as familiar with. And then of course, Simple Mobile, the TrackPhone brand itself, and Straight Talk Wireless. So there's a lot of different brands under this TrackPhone umbrella. It definitely seems like this switch from Total Wireless to Total by Verizon is one of the biggest changes we've seen yet as a result of this acquisition. And it is kind of funny how Total by Verizon almost seems like they got inspiration from Metro by T-Mobile with that naming structure, but I guess they want to make it really clear who they're competing against. So the Total by Verizon website is completely new, and you can go there to shop for devices, refill your plan, you can activate new devices, pretty much everything you'd expect to do. Of course, you can always go to a retail location to do the same thing, but it is nice that we have the ability to do all of this on their website as well. Now, taking a look at their various plans, they do have four of them here, and I really like how they break down all the various differences. It definitely makes things very clear here. But you can see, starting off with how it works, step one, choose your first plan. So find a good plan with one of our four plans, and then of course you get to use Verizon's 5G network as a result of that, because Verizon runs the network behind Total by Verizon. They also have discounts if you wanna buy multiple lines, and they do encourage the option of taking your existing phone and simply adding in their SIM card to use their service on that device. So it's not like you have to buy a brand new phone from Total by Verizon to use the service itself. So we do have different prices based on the amount of lines that you wanna get, for example, all these various prices right here are available if you just want to get one line, but then you can see if you switch over to two lines, that lowers the amount per line. Same thing with three lines, four lines, and then finally five lines really brings down the cost per line. So every plan does include unlimited talk and text, and then if you want to do either the $50 or $60 a month plan, you do get unlimited data with that as well. Now, I'm not going to go over every detail about every plan because you can definitely just see that here for yourself, but you definitely do get various features added as you pay more for your plan. And there certainly is a clear difference between the $30 plan compared to the $60 plan. You're definitely getting a lot more if you pay double the price, which does make sense. And it does seem like as well that they're really promoting this Disney Plus bundle for the top two plans here. And if you go for the $60 a month plan, you get Disney Plus included indefinitely. So if you're already a Disney Plus customer and you're paying for that every month, then I can definitely see how there's definitely a solid value proposition here. And they do make it really clear that if you wanna get multiple lines, you don't have to get the same plan for every line. So based on the needs of each user of each line, you can kind of mix and match things so that everybody gets what they need. But at the same time, you're not paying extra for various features and services that won't be used. So as I showed you before, there are a lot of different locations all around the US that you can find track phone related products at. 
Now, that doesn't necessarily mean you'll find Total by Verizon at all 90,000 of those locations, but you can go onto the Total by Verizon website, search up the various city that you wanna find locations in, and you can see for this example, there are various CVS locations, Walgreens, let's see if I can scroll down a little bit as well, the website's still a little buggy, Target, uh, other grocery stores as well, so, Definitely a lot of options. I'm sure that there's somewhere literally within 10 minutes of you where you can find Total by Verizon. So if you do wanna go and get that traditional in-store experience, you definitely do have the ability to. And I mentioned this in my videos quite a bit, but one of the best ways to save money on a device is buying it directly through the carrier. Now you can pay full price for a phone that's factory unlocked, which is awesome because that gives you the most amount of flexibility, but at the same time, you can often get that same phone for a fraction of the price if you get it from the carrier itself. So on the Total by Verizon website here, you can see that we have quite a few different options. There's the iPhone SE, iPhone XR, iPhone 13. It looks like the iPhone 14 is not on here yet, but there's the Galaxy A03s, Galaxy A53 5G. So a lot of these phones, if not all of them, I have covered here in the channel. Well, haven't covered that Nokia, but most of these phones I have covered here in the channel. There's also some flip phones as well. So there's definitely something here for everybody and something at every single price point. Now, I think the biggest thing that I'm curious about at this point is whether or not we're gonna see dedicated Total by Verizon retail stores similar to what we find with Metro, Cricket, and Boost Mobile. And I'm definitely curious to know what you think about this. Do you think it makes a big difference having a dedicated retail store? Or do you not mind going to somewhere like Walmart where there's a bunch of different brands being sold or going to CVS where maybe they don't sell phones quite as often, but they do still offer them and offer different plans from Total by Verizon? Are you okay with that experience? Or do you want the same experience that you get at Metro, Cricket and Boost where you go in the store and that is the only purpose of that store is just for that carrier? Definitely curious to know what you think, and the reason why that's important is because Verizon does want Total by Verizon to compete against those brands. Now I'm sure there are places in the US that are dedicated for track phone related products. However, I've gotta say, I don't think I've personally ever seen a dedicated track phone retail store, and definitely I've never seen a dedicated Total Wireless retail store. So that is a little bit of a different strategy for selling prepaid devices and prepaid plans, but clearly it has worked for a while because there would be no other way that TrackPhone would have accumulated 20 million customers. So overall, definitely curious to know what you think of Total by Verizon. I know for me at least, I'm really excited to see this change. For a while there, I thought that Total Wireless seemed a little bit redundant compared to the other track phone brands, especially compared to Straight Talk and some of the others. But it looks like with this change, Verizon is definitely making some very big moves with the Total by Verizon brand, and I'm really looking forward to seeing how this plays out as time goes on. But I hope you enjoyed this video. Definitely give it a thumbs up if you did, and I will see you in the next one. Take care and have a great rest of your day.